Hey guys, what's up? This is Trickett, and yes, this is another amazing edition, guys, of Wake Up With Trickett. Real quick, guys, are you on this journey? Is this you? Are you the caterpillar? The caterpillar that <clears throat> is getting ready to go into your dark night of the soul? You left everybody, drop all your karmics, not circling back to bad relationships, bad decisions. You decided that it's just time. It's time for a change. It's time to just stop playing with your life. It's time to have your, give your life a, a real purpose with real meaning. Are you on this road right now? You're that, cal you're that caterpillar. It's all by itself. No family, no friends. Because what you have to do, you have to do it alone. Because if you were able to do it with the people that you know, you would have been where you needed to be. You would have been feeling the way you needed to feel. Are you tired? Because being alone takes a lot. And then purging and growing and learning. You know, going through it. Do you get tired along the road? You just stop. Look, you're just like, I'm tired. I'm just tired right now. <laughs> but you know you can't stay still for long. You know you have to keep moving. You know eventually you have to continue to keep pushing forward. You know that you are going to have to. You're going to find your cocoon. Like this guy here. He's gonna find a place to make his cocoon and he's gonna stay there, he or she. And they're gonna go through whatever they have to go through alone. No breaks in between. It doesn't work like that. You can't cheat, you can't cheat the system <laughs> and then try to still get amazing results. You just got to have a determination and a mindset. You just want to go through it. So once you go through it, you went through it. It's done. See? You get back up and you're like, all right, forget it. I'm going. I know I can do it. I know I can make it. I know I can make this happen. And then what happens? You get obstacles put in your way, right? And so you climb over them, right? Because you're like, whatever, man. I'm, just, I'm tired. Then you get what? More obstacles put in your way, right? And you're finding out, man, so what? I don't care. I got determination. I'm going over. I'm climbing over these obstacles. There's nothing going to stop me. Nothing. I'm going to change my life. I'm going to find my way. I'm going to live the life that I want to live. No one's going to stop me. I'm looking. I'm looking. I'm, cr I'm climbing over all hurdles all obstacles I'm climbing over I don't care what it takes I'm tired of being tired I'm sick and tired of being sick and tired I'm I'm climbing over everything it does not matter to me I am getting rid of everything that does not serve me I am on my way of my dark night of the soul to get rid of all of the things that do not serve me so I can become a better person, so I can attract better people. Why am I attracting karmics in my life? Why am I wasting my time with people that are no good for me? Another obstacle? Are you serious? Can I go over it? Can I go under it? What are my options? Do I have any? You keep trying, you keep falling back down. Okay, it must be another way. And so you take off and you try to go another way. And you're like, well, let me try it again. Maybe I can go this way. Maybe I can get up this way because it'll probably be easier. But see, when something's not meant for you, it's not meant. That's like God, the most high, the universe saying this isn't the way to go. 
and you just keep trying it and keep trying it and it just keeps doesn't work it doesn't work and you get a little tired and you're just like okay wait a minute forget this let me go the opposite way because now you start to figure it out right you're like well maybe this isn't maybe this isn't the road for me maybe that wall wasn't meant for me to climb so you go the opposite way you look for another route but you never stop you never stop you keep going because you have determination now you're 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 serious about your mission now you understand that your life has a value now you don't need anybody to take with you on this mission you'll find them when they come out and nine times out of ten when you come out it will never be with the same people that you left behind when you had to do this mission alone that's why you're doing it alone they were never meant to be with you they were there some people are there for a reason some people are there for a season some people are there to teach you a lesson and some people are there for a lifetime Where are you guys at? Where are you guys at on this journey? Where are you at? Are you are you the caterpillar? Are you the caterpillar? Let's see where did this guy go? I'm in the back, guys. But are you the caterpillar? There he goes. See, he's fine. He's, he's running into obstacles. There's another obstacle. Man, how the heck? What the heck? How do I get past this? Let me see if I can climb this one. Let me see if I can get around it. Let me see what, what, what can I do? Can I get a breakthrough? Are you guys here yet? Have you started this journey? Are you still on that? I got to accumulate more karmic stuff in my life. More bad karma. Are you determined like this guy here? Guy or girl? To get their life right, to make it better, to, 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 to be a value. Are you a value? Are you known for anything? Anything positive? Or are you just known for laying down and gapping them? Are you known for just going back to bad karmic relationships and you just look like the biggest clown in your community because everybody's like, ah, yeah, she always does that. She's not the brightest person on the block. Or he always does that. He's not the brightest person on the block. He's toxic. <laughs> or you like this guy. You're like, forget that. I got up on this one. I found a way up here. I don't know if this is where I need to be, but I know I got up here. I know that I know this wall didn't stop me. I know I'm looking down for, for a change instead of looking up from the ground up. You know the beautiful thing about this, guys? Is that once you go through this, transition from a caterpillar to a beautiful butterfly you are never on the ground like this again you're never ten toes on the ground no more you see everything from a bird's eye view see right here birds can still come down and pluck you you're still in danger it's still danger zone that's where you have to find. That's why. That's that's why you're looking for, for for a place. Not. It's not necessarily to hide. It's just a place to transform. You're ready to transform. You're ready to, to to become, who you were meant to become. You're ready to become. Your purpose. And you know you have one. And you know it's not what you've been doing. You know it's not the life you've been living. You know that's not it. <laughs> Nobody wants your life. Nobody thinks you're going to have an amazing life. Nobody even wants you to teach them anything. Because they're like, why? Your choices are garbage. Your relationships are garbage. You're confused. You don't even know who your true identity is. You know who you're... What your true identity is, for the most part. 
You're still worried about what other people think, what other people say. You know, all that crippling weakness that people like to embody. I want to be weak today. I really care about what you say. I could care less about what you say. You ain't saying anything that's going to uplift me, encourage me, motivate me. If it's not constructive criticism, and then anything else is just hateration. It's just jealousy. It's just another groupie of mine. It's just going to dismiss you. Because what can you do? Nothing. Period. And that's it on that. I don't care. See, guys? You got to be like this guy. He's not worried about it. He's not worried about nothing. He don't care about what nobody thinks, what nobody says, he or she. They don't care. They made their, she, this person has made up their mind to do what they have to do. Period. All alone, whether they know the answers or not. See? Confused. I'm up here. But now where do I go? I'm not on the ground now, but maybe I need to go back down because maybe this wasn't the right way. I thought it was the right way. And see, God will let you do all of that. Like, yeah, I'm going to let you kind of like, you know, just... Ponder a little bit because it's all a part of the process And then see like your enemies or somebody else that doesn't see this process will be thinking yeah, we have victory Because they're slow It worked <laughs> No genius. It was all a part of the plan and you were a part of the plot You were just too slow to know that you were part of the plot <laughs> You thought what you did you actually came up with no genius it was all a part of the plot. If you knew that this caterpillar would be a butterfly, you would have stopped it at a caterpillar. But you didn't have the wisdom of knowing while you were, you know, celebrating your, your temporary, what looked like, illusional win. This person right here had bigger plans to make history, to be way bigger than you. This person's life will be your karma because you'll have to watch it every day. Every day. How many tears will you drop? How much heartache and pain will you have to live with year after year? You know, it's crazy how karma comes back. But it's crazy how good karma rewards people that do right. See this guy? He's like, man, I am determined. I am determined. I don't know where I'm going. I don't know how I'm going to get there. But when it's all over, I'm getting my wings, period. I'm getting my butterfly wings. I'm tired of being on the ground, ten toes down, with every other karmic element that's on the ground, ten toes down, and all their craziness. He wants his wings. And then look what over here. Look what we got over here. And this is what starts to happen. Look. We got another caterpillar that said, you know what? I'm taking my journey. I'm tired too. Wherever you're at, bro, wherever you're at, sis, look. <laughs> I'm ready. And look, they're not even taking it together. Look. They're like, I'll see you at the top when we're flying as butterflies. And we can both share our stories. And we can both talk about what we went through. You know what I'm saying? Our healing. Our, 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 just, our, our journey. I could tell you all my obstacles that I had. And what I had to overcome. All the times I didn't know where I was going. I thought I knew where I was going, but I, I, I just didn't want to go back to where I was. And then this person's over here. They're where he was just not too long ago. Just like that. Wasn't moving. Was just stuck, tired. Like I know I have to do this, but oh God, man. Just give me the strength. Give me the strength to go through whatever I have to go through so I can get my butterfly wings. People left me for, they just left me left me for dead, left me just considered I'd never be nothing, just considered I'd never make it, just even though all the love you put out, they just, you know, they just 
put that negative energy in. At this stage, you don't even know nothing about it. So it's consuming you. You're tired. No help, no love, no support. And then over here, this person's a little bit further than where you were. They got down from where they were because everyone's like, I guess this isn't the way either. Because, you know, God will let you try all kinds of different ways because all of this is a part of the journey. He's like, nope, let me come back down ten toes on the ground again because apparently this also is not the way for me he was already where the other person was, not moving. Just staying still, thinking about it, trying to figure it out. He says, I'm not there no more. I'm moving. I got things to do, places to go. I want my butterfly wings. I'm going to crawl over everything. I'm going to run over everything. I'm cutting off anything that comes in my way that is not a part of this process. Period. This is why this person will be successful. This is why good things will happen to him or her. Good karma will come to him or her because God sees that they are for real. They're not turning back. They're not picking up nothing. They're not going back to nothing. Back is nothing. Back, back is a reminder of what never to go back to. They're moving forward. On the other hand, This guy right here is still, still stuck. But they're stuck in a good way because they're by themselves and they're on the journey. They just haven't started to move again because they're just tired. They're just like, I don't know where to go, what to do, man. Like, I look all around and I don't see nothing. But God is with them because they've answered the call. Everybody's call. But only few are chosen. That's why when you're chosen and people mess with you, they get dealt with in ways they wish they just would have never touched the chosen one. And so this one, he's going off to be chosen and she's going off to be chosen. So is that other one. So is that other one. This one's just more motivated. This one's just like, I'm just ready now. <laughs> I'm tired of staying still. And even though it's had obstacle after obstacle, He's off to get his wings, or she's off to get her wings. And live that amazing life, guys. And attract amazing people, and help broken people, so they, so they can become amazing people. And you'll feel amazing by doing it. You'll feel great. You don't feel good being a karmic. You think you do, but no, you don't. So anyway, guys, are you off on your journey? Are you, is this where you're at in life? Is it? Hopefully it is. Or hopefully you already made this trip. And now, you know, you're on the up and up. Everything's going up for you. But wherever you're at in life, guys, if you haven't made this trip, you're going to have to make this trip. If you've already made this trip, and then help somebody to get there so they can become better. So they can become better, just like you. So they can know what gifts they have. So they can find love. So they can avoid karmic. So they can know what to do. What to look out for. How to fix it when it's broken. How to meditate correctly. To get the right results. If you are not here. And you're already on the next level. Help somebody else guys. Because if you ain't reaching back to help somebody else. Then what are you doing? And never let no one play with your energy. Protect your energy. For any of my empaths out there, you guys feel energy. And if you're connected to anybody that may have negative energy, say they're karmic, they're just not living right, and you can feel their energy, cut the cord, bro, because they're not going to respect you, or he's not respecting you, or she's not respecting your energy. They're being selfish. They know they're throwing you negative energy and they want you to deal with it. Cut the cord. Cut the cord, live your life. Be happy. Wish them well. They'll deal with their own karma and misery. And with that being said, guys, you guys are all amazing. 
I hope this was helpful. I am Trickett, and you guys are just all wonderful people on this Money Making Meditation Monday. Stay blessed. Peace out. <laughs>